Nudibranchs, the real-life Pokemon of the sea. These vibrant, colorful creatures are favorites among photographers and marine enthusiasts, but what exactly are nudibranchs? Well, welcome to all things nudibranch. The name nudibranch comes from the Latin word nudus and the Greek word branchia, meaning naked gill. These fascinating sea slugs belong to the class gastropoda, which includes snails, sea hares, and other sea slugs. Gastropods fall under the phylum mollusca, a diverse group that also includes octopuses, squids, clams, and oysters. There are over 3,000 known species of nudibranchs, making them an incredibly diverse and colorful group of animals. Did you know the smallest nudibranch, the candelabra nudibranch, reaches a maximum size of just 15 millimeters? On the other hand, the largest, the giant Spanish dancer nudibranch, can grow up to 50 centimeters long. That's almost 20 inches. Nudibranchs typically have shorter lifespans, ranging from a few weeks to around a year. They are very abundant in shallow tropical waters, especially around coral reefs, but they can be found in oceans all across the globe. As benthic animals, nudibranchs primarily crawl over sponges, corals, or the seafloor rather than free swimming in the water column, but there are a couple of anomalies within the nudibranchs. Some species are even found in polar regions, proving their adaptability to different environments. Nudibranchs get their name naked gills from the exposed feathery gills on their backs. These structures help them to breathe underwater. Depending on the family, they may also have serrata, which are spiky appendages that aid in gas exchange and oftentimes serve as a form of chemical defense. Their colors and patterns are more than just stunning. They serve as a warning to predators about their toxicity. Many nudibranchs can consume toxic animals like sponges or anemones and incorporate the toxins into their own bodies. Some species, like the blue glaucus or blue dragon sea slug, even reuse stinging cells from their prey, such as the Portuguese man-of-war, and store them in their serrata for protection. This process is known as kleptonidae. It's a unique adaptation that showcases their resourcefulness. Despite their dazzling appearances, nudibranchs cannot even see their own colors. Their eyes are very simple, detecting only light and shadows. Instead, they rely on their rhinophores, these ear-like structures on their heads, to sense chemicals in the water, helping them to find food as well as mates and pheromones. Some species also have oral tentacles near their mouths, which help in exploring their surroundings and detecting prey. Nudibranchs are carnivores for the most part with highly specialized diets. While species vary, common prey include sponges, anemones, barnacles, and even other nudibranchs. Interestingly enough, their diet often influences their coloration, providing camouflage or making their toxicity more apparent to potential predators. This connection between their diet and their appearance highlights the intricate relationships that nudibranchs have with their ecosystems. All nudibranchs are simultaneous hermaphrodites, meaning they have both male and female reproductive organs. When they find a mate, often by following slime trails or using their chemical sensing rhinophores, both of these individuals exchange sperm. The fertilized eggs are then laid in colorful, spiral-shaped masses, which increase the chances of survival for their offspring. Each species has its own unique egg-laying patterns, but the vibrant egg ribbons are a common sight for divers that explore the coral reefs. Some species produce thousands of eggs at a time, ensuring that at least a few survive despite the many threats in their environments. Nudibranchs are split into several families, with Dorid and Aeolid nudibranchs being the most commonly seen. Dorid nudibranchs have a branchial plume of exposed gills on their posterior end. They oftentimes are found feeding on sponges and are known for their more rounded body shapes. Aeolid nudibranchs are known for their serrata, which can sometimes be sacrificed to distract predators. They oftentimes display more elongated bodies and are famous for their vibrant colors and unique behaviors. Famous species of nudibranchs out there include the sea bunny nudibranch, which resembles a fluffy rabbit, the blue glaucus or blue dragon, which incorporates stinging cells from its prey, the Portuguese man-of-war, the Pikachu nudibranch, named for its resemblance to the Pokemon character. There's also the neon nudibranch with its stunning green hues. The ghost nudibranch, whose transparent body actually reveals its insides. And each of these species adds to the incredible biodiversity of nudibranchs, showcasing their adaptability and beauty. Nudibranchs play a vital role in marine ecosystems. By feeding on sponges, anemones, and other benthic organisms, they help to maintain ecological balance on coral reefs and other environments. Their predatory behaviors can also control the populations of their prey, contributing to the overall health of their habitats. 
Divers and researchers oftentimes use nudibranch sightings as indicators of ecosystem health, as their presence can signal a thriving underwater world. Studying these creatures provides valuable insights into the complexities of marine biodiversity. So there you have it, all things nudibranch. These incredible creatures are as fascinating as they are beautiful with their dazzling colors, unique adaptations, and critical ecological roles. What's your favorite marine animal? Let me know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe for more deep dives into the ocean's wonders like nudibranchs.